just tiptoeing with my wrinkles. Don't want to get them too much, and I want to see where the variations are. Like this is a little bit darker through here than it is maybe here or here, and uh, and then as I'm as I'm looking at these things, I want to see where is that going to cross over. Oh, it looks like it could cross over right there, just subtly. Maybe I better go back to my 4H and make sure that I'm I'm going to have something that's soft, something that I'm still going to be able to control give it as much definition as I want, but not too much, just because. So, what can I line it up with? Well, here's this coming up here, just a little. I'm just going to give myself a little indication, not to try and get everything, but I just, I'm just seeing that little variation. I think I'll just put it on there. And it gives me one more little anchor point, one more little cross in the road. And it's not, again, I said, uh, you know, it's not necessary maybe to have it exact. I don't want to photograph a copy, uh, but I still want it to, I want to keep training myself to uh, be accurate enough that when I draw something, it has the uh, proportion, the character, and all the different things that I see in my subject. Uh, we're learning, you know, we're, we're practicing on these hands, and yet it's going to really, if we, if we continue thinking about uh, these things that help us uh, come up with the uh, similarity uh, in the character, we're going to be able to do that with a face. I think many of you, that's, you know, that's some of your primary goals out there. Some of you may not necessarily care for faces, but I don't care what it is. You can express it in a profound way. I think that's kind of the fun thing of taking something that you wouldn't think would be interesting at all and make it interesting. Find that find that something about it that brings out the character and dimension and just makes that object you know profound, I guess. Makes it communicate. So I'm gradually, you know, working in some of this. Uh, area into the shaded palm and uh, and I, I don't want to get too fast I just for me I don't want to I just want to have fun just want to be able to know uh, that uh, boy if I'm patient boy, I can really make this almost look believable I can make it almost real even though I thought it was complicated before look at what I'm able to do just because I slowed it down and started just feeling and, and expressing all these parts, because I know I can. Wonderful opportunity.